Hello everyone. We are gathered to here to represent our research based on deforestation controlling and forest monitoring system. In here you can see our prototype design that we build up to gather the information from the forest that uh, depends on the weather situations and the firing situations and the smoke detections and the what are the uh, available factors that uh, we, we use some several sensors to gain a lot of information to process some idea to get some more advanced uh, forest monitoring system to the uh, our research. So that is basically we are belongs to the mobile application and the website and this prototype. In first step, first of all, we introduce our basic uh, prototype that we build it. In a, you can see in here solar panel, the standalone solar panel, and also this is the our prototype module that we created. So when we are talking about the prototype that we created, you can see it based on some several uh, sensors belongs to that. So in the forest, uh, you can see uh, we ha when we are monitoring the forest, so basically we have to get that uh, temperature and humidity and the fire detectors and the smoke detectors and the soil moisture and the soil temperature. So basically you can see in here, so the major thing for the, that prototype, uh, it will gain a renewable energy source. So basically you can see the solar panel in here, it gained 5 kilo, 5 watt for the particular device. So this is standalone power system, it is uh, charging with the daytime and the working standalone with the battery pack along the night time. So, so I can I can explain one by one. So you can see in the close up session. So in here you can see the humidity and atmospheric temperature, uh, and here the LP gas sensors. Uh, in this gas sensors, you can you can um, we can measure the LP LP gas level and the hydrogen level and the carbon monoxide level, and also the smoking detections. So we have created both sensors in the both side because uh, in sometimes uh, it can be happen either uh, the sensor this side uh, right side and the to and the left side. So to get uh, uh, the fully accurate data, we create uh, LR signals from the particular those informations. And uh, I can explain one by one. So in the humidity, we are getting the humidity to change. How many how many number of uh, uh, rains and uh, how how uh, how about the uh, atmospheric temperature while the while cutting tree? So when the cutting tree trees, it is definitely affect to the humidity and the atmospheric temperature. And also when the when the deforestation in some uh, the the, uh, from the people they are doing deforestation and also that uh, naturally happen from the uh, uh, wildfire. So when it's come to the wildfire, so in here that in the gas sensors, it can identify LP gas level and also the smokes. From the smoke detections, when smoke is come up and it will be uh, sensors into the our mobile application and the, from the web portal, it gained the uh, IoT level uh, messages for that particular uh, website and the uh, mobile application. We can uh, demonstrate that within the, uh, we can create a, a artificial uh, smoke in here. You can see we have the artificial smoke in here. So when the smoke is coming up to this, uh, our sensors, it will be indicate some uh, that uh, smoke is detection. It can identify with the, that particular sensors. You can see that a lot of uh, siren knowledge, sirens are available in here. Okay, now I can explain. This is uh, the our admin panel, admin portal that will be give for the deforestation controlling and forest monitoring department. So it it contain you can see in the Google map in here and the humidity percentage and the atmospheric temperature, battery level of that our particular device and the soil temperature and the soil moisture values, hydrogen contribution 
and the smoke concentration, carbon co monoxide concentration, and LPG concentration. So we can demonstrate now if we have some kind of a fire, wildfire, or some kind of emergency situation, we can uh, simulate that using this uh, smoke, smoke, the virtual smoke. So you can see in that our uh, admin panel how it is look like for the admin from the admin managers. So we have uh, uh, the virtual smoke in here. So one it, uh, once uh, that uh, wildfire is happen, so our prototype device can that can be identify that particular uh, smoke is come up with that particular device. So you can see now. So it is it is it is showing the fire situation is come up, and the entire entire screens are changed. So and you can see the location that fire is detected. You can see that uh, you can see in the Google map. So it will automatically navigate to the the particular uh, place that fire is happened. So this is basically for the admin panel and the admin view for the monitoring department. Now you can see the mobile responsive web page that we created for the our uh, people that the near near for the that particular forest and uh, if, if if they can uh, log into the, our web portal they can access whether that uh, humidity level and uh, where it is located and the atmospheric temperature battery percentage soil and moisture level that hydrogen capacity the entire thing they can get the notifications uh, from the their mobile applications once they are registered with our forest monitoring system so i can i can i can demonstrate that uh, when the fire fire is detected from the particular device how it is message go through the particular uh, our customers from that using our services so you can see in here that our mobile application so once it it will come up with the firing detection you can see now it will get get a message the fire situation is happened and already it gonna be a uh, that location uh, where that uh, particular uh, fire is detected and also it it gonna be changed every uh, details inside of that view that is basically for the customer user privileges that we are giving for once our platform registered users so finally this is our entire uh, research based on the mobile application mobile view website development and the admin panel portal for the forest monitoring departments and also this will be the prototype that is standalone power system with the solar and uh, it is based on the uh, two uh, smoke detectors and uh, that uh, LPG gas and the uh, hy hydrogen and the carbon monoxide detectors and the humidity level and the, uh, the uh, temperature of the atmosphere. And uh, you can see in the, that there are two wires are going through it. Uh, in the uh, two wires, you can get uh, uh, soil moisture level and the soil temperature also. So these are the, the monitor, monitoring sensors then uh, when we are plugging into the uh, soil so this is the soil temperature this is the waterproof sensor uh, that can get uh, soil temperature and this is a soil moisturing level so water level uh, how much uh, soil moisture is available we can get the, those the uh, sensor values from these particular two sensors you can see it already connected into the our prototype and that values also come up to the our web portal and uh, mobile applications as well. So basically this is our total solution for the, our uh, research. So you can get an idea and leave a comment below. Thank you very much.